The Bobcats game plan for tonight against Kent State was to shut down number 23, Jalen Walker. He's the current scoring leader in the entire MAC, but after tonight, nothing's going to change. He got his exact scoring average on the entire year, 21 points, and that was enough for him in the Golden Flashes to take down the Bobcats 66 to 52. And speaking of Walker, he got off to his normal hot start. First four points for the Golden Flashes came from him, and all the while keeping the Bobcats scoreless until the 16 minute mark. Their offense did get going though. Jason Carter right here with a nice pump bait, gets by his defender and finds Ben Vanderplas cutting down the middle for an easy dunk. They didn't have much help on offense from their point guard though. Tavion Kirk, he was struggling offensively zero from six to start the game and ended four of 23 from the field. There were some stretches of shot making in the first half though. They went four out of their last five, ending with this James going three that cut the lead down to three, but after that, it was all Kent State to end the first half. They went on a 16-6 run, and it seemed like the Bobcats could have been out of it early, but they gave themselves life early in the second half with this Jason Carter rejection in the post, and Antonio Coward gets it on the run, and no one's stopping him. A nice finish on the other side of the basket for him. That's in the midst of an 8-0 run, capped off by this Doug Taylor and one. This free throw ties it up, but after that, it was all Kent State. Jalen Avery for three. That bucket made it a 9-0 run for the Golden Flashes and put the game away for them. After the game, Coach Saul Phillips talked about their struggles offensively. I thought we looked tentative at times. We had 18 offensive rebounds, and yet, uh, you know, we couldn't generate enough offense. I think just from a pure shooting standpoint, four for 20 from three and eight for 16 from the free throw line says a lot about our ability to make shots. Next off for the Bobcats is a road contest. That's Friday against Toledo. For now, I'm Nick Niehaus for WAB.